I think uh, Gothenburg is becoming one of those worldwide hotspots for electromobility. You know, there's everything from cars to buses to boats and now airplanes being built here. We see challenges from the marine sector, for example, with electrification, with the flight industry, with the automotive industry that are, have similar challenges. So I think by binding these things together, we do have an opportunity to do something great. The city of Gothenburg has a goal of achieving a fossil-free transportation system by the year 2030. But we would like to take it even further. We would like to achieve a totally emission-free zone in the city of Gothenburg by the year 2030. The Gothenburg Green City Zone is unique because of its scale. We can't find any zones in the same scale as we have here anywhere in the world. We have to transform the cities that we live in. Sustainable transportation, safe transportation and convenient transportation all in one. That's what the Gothenburg Green City Zone is all about. In the Green City Zone we are going to reduce the number of parking spots at street level. We will see more and more cars being shared the aircraft that we're building is called the ES-19, so it's an all-electric aircraft driven by electric motors, batteries and propellers. It will initially fly short routes under 400 kilometers and have zero emissions. In order to get to the climate goals of the Paris Agreement, it's not enough just to decarbonize our small countries. The thing that really excites us about this airplane is that it can work, obviously in the Nordics, in Europe, in North America, and also in the emerging market of Asia and Africa. By 2024, we'll build our first flight test aircraft. And by 2026, the aircraft will then be certified and we can hand it over to our first customers and enter into commercial service. SEAL will launch spring 2023. I think Gothenburg has a huge opportunity. We have all the different companies, we have the universities, and we have the competence. Gothenburg is uh, at the forefront, definitely, and we build our uh, quest for innovation on the partnerships that uh, we have as a tradition in the city. Well, next year we will invite companies from all over the world to come and uh, pitch their solutions for us in, in a living lab. So we would like to invite them to make partnerships with the Swedish companies and test and develop their solutions in the Gothenburg Green City Zone. So.